Okay, um, this little activity is going to show you just kind of a simple connects activity for making what I like to call a basic robotics um, tool, okay? And of course, there's no motor involved and there's no real servos or electronics, but one of the things that this will do is it will show you, or if you're giving your students this activity, it will show them some of the complications involved in robots and robotics and getting robotics to do what we really want them to do. Okay, so what you're going to need is you're going to need two red rods, you're going to need two blue rods, you will need a white rod, a white rod, and you will need two yellow connectors, two green connectors, and two dark gray connectors, and a blue spacer. Um, you can improvise these parts depending on your kit and what you have in your kit. Uh, modify it, whatever. Okay, blue spacer, I like to throw it in there because it kind of adds a little bit to the actual quality of the design. Okay, so anyways, the first thing that you want to do is you want to take your yellow connector and a red rod, put that together like that. Take your other yellow connector and red rod, put them together like so. Okay, then what you do is you take your green connector and you put it on the end of a red rod. Then you take your other green connector and you put it on the end of the red rod like so. All right? Then you take your blue rod, connect it in like that, and your other blue rod, whoops, connect it in, that was bad, connect it in just like that, okay? So now we have our basic components for what we're trying to build. And then we're going to hinge these, and so you're going to flip this over, and it's essentially you're going to make them look like a pair of scissors. And when you do that, you want to put this blue spacer on there just to keep it operating smooth, and then a dark gray connector like that. Then take your other part like so, and then, of course, there you go. Now, when we did this, okay, we now have a basic tool for picking stuff up. Just basically a set of tongs, okay? But what's interesting about this is you can shorten these and you can lengthen these. You can build finger grips on here. You can tape the, your fingers onto here and really get a sense of what it's like to try and pick something up using robotic hands. And what you discover is that, yeah, you know, the idea of robotics may be simple, but our hands, our fingers, have full of senses, and they can really determine how much pressure to put on something. If something moves, they can adjust for it. And so this activity allows you to build a tool which you know, kind of like gives you an idea of what the complications are with robotics, okay? And so feel free to take this and modify it any way you want. You can you know, put little finger, finger holders here, that sort of thing. Adjust it, do as you want with it, okay? You could even build them side by side, a couple of them, and see if it could grip even better, bigger, all right? So that is a simple robotics type activity where you teach yourself about robotics, okay? And picking up, okay? Oh, another thing is you could challenge kids to build a better grip on the end here as well. You know, keep things from rolling off, pick up different items. Anyways, there you go. A very simple project doesn't require a whole lot of parts.